my heart. And we're back with Money Smarts. Hey. Now, we went out with the question, you got all these debts, okay. and you have more money going out than you have coming in. Okay. How would you address that? Well, that's the number one issue that I deal with, first of all, so that's a very good question. Okay. The first step is to distinguish your wants versus your needs. Okay. Now, if you were to get it out of a sheet of paper and jot down everything and every place your money goes, mm -hmm. and then go behind that and cross out the needs, uh -huh. not the wants, but the needs, uh -huh. that will free up money right there. Okay. First of all. Right. I don't want to give all the secrets away okay. in the middle of the street. I'm going to kind of keep them, you know, on the edge of their seats. Okay. But we want to get back to that. Now, you're available. You go out to churches or businesses and you talk about this kind of stuff? I go or to do whoever do is in need. Okay. Whoever can use my services, I'm willing to go. Okay. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Now, we have another chart there. Yes. Uh, the second. And that's what you were talking about. Go on. Yeah. Second step is to do this. This was my Christmas present to myself ah. uh, a year and a half ago. These were my cards, my credit cards, and they were all open and being used at one time. Mm. And I'm happy to say at this time that they're all cut off, paid, and closed off. Praise the Lord. Now, how long ago? About two years. Two years ago. We're, two now, years. what kind of balances are we talking? $100? We're talking a total of thirteen nine eighty five. dollars That's really? 13000 Yes. Wow. 13000 13000 In two the, years. In about two years. Because of Money wow. Smarts, I was able to pay off all of them. And I look at this uh, daily, and I just praise yes, God Yes, praise for this. the Lord. I just yeah. received that anointing that come on me. In Jesus' right. name, amen. Let's do it. <laughs> yes. Uh, that's great. Uh, this Chris is the number one problem for, for most of us. Yes. Especially the interest in these uh -huh. cards. Uh -huh. You know, it, it will kill you. Okay. You end up paying three or four times the amount um, of the purchase, uh -huh. and, and, wow. and that's where a lot of the money goes. So wow. if you can cut this out, and instead of paying out the interest, keeping it to you, then you have extra money mm -hmm. to pay off the debts and Amen. to tie, Amen. and have money left over. Hmm, I like that. Now we're talking about life more abundantly, opening, open up the windows of heaven. Talk to me. What about that? Well, we know that if we tie, mm -hmm. tie correctly, correctly, what is correctly? Generally speaking, 10% of, of okay. our earnings. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, is that what, gross? What a lot invest? of people want to know, is that gross or what I actually get in my hand? Right. Well, <laughs> I'll put it like my marriage instructor told me. Okay. Do you want a gross blessing or a net blessing from God? Oh, well, hey. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Use okay. that and All right. that lead you. Very good. Okay. Uh, but you know, in, in order for that to happen, to take uh -huh. place, you, you need to do what God says. You, can't, you cannot rob God. That's and then true. expect him yes. to bless you more abundantly. Amen, amen. So you got all these bills. You need to pay your tithes, okay? Say like an average person. Here's a mother okay. with one child, and that's the only income she has. Okay. And uh, let's say she's getting seven fifty every two weeks. Okay. So that's seventy five dollars out of that, okay? Mm -hmm. Seven fifty, that's fifteen hundred a month in her hand. Okay. Okay. So She's tithing, she's giving, you know, giving, so she has rent. She has, what, expenses for the children. She's got child care. Okay. I mean, all this stuff. Right. Now, prior, prioritizing, is that right? Yes. So you work with people to sh the important things first or... Yeah.